hello wordpress people so this is the video about wordpress personal verification update so let's see what's new in this new update so let's see so this is the latest version 1.5.0 which has a new learn this integration so now yeah for uh, WordPress personal verification is now compatible with LearnDash and if you don't know what LearnDash is so it is to make your WordPress site into a learning platform and uh, if you don't know what personal verification is then you should watch out this playlist first and then come back again on the video and if you know how the personal verification works for the wordpress then keep continue watching this video before jumping into the code if you are new to Gutenberg development then i would suggest to watch or review this website called the wpvoyage.com this has very good tips and tricks regarding Gutenberg development and Gutenberg editor so please go and check out this site thank you so uh, first of all uh, I have already updated my personal verification plugin I have installed LearnDash plugin as well and then in the LearnDash I have created some courses so let me show you that first if we go inside courses we will be able to see the list of courses so here i have created three courses so type of courses are closed for these two courses wordpress and sample course and this is the free type course so now let me show you how what are the differences between free course and closed course i'm gonna go to front side of my site and here i have added courses page so here we are able to see these three courses so let's go inside the php which was free and here we can take this course by our own by clicking on this button now let's go back to the courses page again and let's go to the wordpress site uh, sorry wordpress course and here we can see that we are not enrolled into course but we are not able to join the course by our own so similarly for uh, third course which was closed so let's let me show you that as well the sample course so again there is no way to um, enroll inside enroll to this course so how persona verification works with learn dash so let's go to the persona verification setting first and here we can select the courses in which we want to auto enroll users when a persona verification verifies a user so meaning when user verify via persona verification they will be auto enrolled into that uh, selected courses so here i have selected those two close courses so whenever the user is verified via persona they will be auto enrolled to the course so let me show you that 
so for that here i have already logged in with a test user so let me show you that first that this user is not verified yet so the user will not be able to visit any of the page if the user tries to visit any of the page that user will be redirected to the verification page always so now let's go ahead and verify the persona verification and this is the sandbox uh, verification it's not the real verification so let's begin the verification So now user is verified let's click done and it will automatically redirect to to the home page so now user will be able to access the pages on the site let me show you that so as you can see now user is able to access the pages let's go to courses So based on the setting uh, users should auto enroll to these two courses WordPress and Sample Course. Let's go to the WordPress. As you can see uh, there is no button for auto enroll and because user is already enrolled and able to see the page content and if you can show you that uh, if user is not enrolled then they will see this kind of box and they won't be able to see the other content of the course so the user is auto enrolled to the wordpress course now let's confirm for another course So let's go to the sample course and here also user is able to see the course content and it is auto on enrolled so yeah this is how persona verification works with learners if you have any doubt or question please write down below in the comment section thanks for watching the video guys